Good evening, friendos. It's time for Quest for Semi-Glory. New game tonight. This is Axiom Verge 2. Um, if memory serves, when this was first released, I want to say more than a year ago by now, um, it was Epic Games exclusive for that year, so we promptly ignored it, um, because I am not one to cotton to exclusivity deals or to boot up the Epic Game Store or whatever, because I don't really like it. Um, but hey, more power to the devs for getting paid, whatever. But now, it's not exclusive on the Epic Game Store anymore, so here, we're gonna play it. Um, I don't remember a whole heck of a lot about Axiom Verge 1, other than it was a very good game. So I'm hoping Axiom Verge 2 is also good. Let's start a new game. Oh, and we get lore, like, right off the bat. That's fine, that's fine. In the year 2007, young scientist Dr. Elizabeth Hammond revolutionized the world as we know it with the invention of the first ever Ansible, or superluminal communicator. Superluminal, huh? Zero latency computing soon became the standard in Hammond Corp, a household name. In 2053, ah, okay, fast forward 46 years, bizarre unexplained tragedy fell Jones Station, Antarctica. An entire research team helmed by Hammond Corp vanished without a trace. Dr. Hammond was with them, she was never seen again. Founded CEO of Company Founder. Indra Chowdhury, founder and CEO of the Globe 3 conglomerate, sees the opportunity to purchase the majority of Hammond Corp and its subsidiaries, thus eliminating her biggest competitor. Acquisition included Hammond's original Ansible prototype. Indra powered it up, she received a message. Come to Antarctica if you wish to see your daughter again. Hmm, weird. As it happened, Globe had just inherited Hammond Corp's contract for the defunct Jones Station in Antarctica. What would she find there? I don't know. I guess we're going to find out. Because presumably that's the opening lord of the game, right? So off we go to Antarctica. I'm a strangely static chop. Oh, here we go. Alright. God, Antarctica though. Fucking cold. Cold as hell. No thanks. Let's wait with the chopper while I get the power online. It hasn't been occupied for over a year. Call me when you're ready. Okay, very good. Hey, game over. How you doing? Good to see you. All right, so let's see what we got here. Uh, we got move. Got to jump. Damn, why can everybody in every game jump over twice their height? Fuck, I wish I could do that. Um. X doesn't do anything, Y is nothing, B is nothing, triggers are nothing. Oh! Uh, left bumper looks like it locks our movement. Okay, that's probably for aim or something. Oh, we've got a flashlight, perhaps. Uh, triggers... Oh, stick click. Turned on the flashlight. Okay. Alright, here we are. Hey, Omega Weapon, how you doing? Good to see you. Let's go have a look around. Oh, we can do a little... We can do a little crouch. A little crouch and sneak. All right, let's go in the store. What do we got? Oh, ice axe. That's a good heft. Could probably use this to break through wood too. All right, damage 25, cooldown 15. All right, use axe. Oh, damn. It's a hell of a fucking wind up. That sound is also very loud. Unfortunate part about this is it's nearly down to nothing. All right, we'll turn it down to like almost nothing. That's better. That's better. All right, break the fuck out of wood. Very good. There's nothing important in these boxes. Okay, some boxes are louder than others. Oh, that looks like a thing that's gonna fall if we step on it. <laughs> okay, it didn't, that's fine. <laughs> it's fine. I see. We would have had to get the axe just to get over here, I guess, huh? Yep, 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 yep. <laughs> jump over twice your height, but it requires using a double jump. I catch your <laughs> Oh no, why? Why though? All I wanted was to jump high. Alright, but okay. Alright, so this, this place is busted. Oh, and we can, uh, can look around too. I guess that's technically our aim. Okay, that's fine. That's, that's good lighting. That's good lighting effects already. Okay, not 
sure if I'm going to be using analog stick or D-pad just yet. Have a look around and see what we can see. Dark and cold up here in the Antarctica. Shiny glowy thing. What do we got? Meeting notes from 2053. I guess it is later in the year 2053, isn't it? Snow needs new tires. Ran out of garbanzo. Chef wants to know if post, post Arctic garbanzo is safe. EU team needs fuel for the cargo chopper. Z hearing voices at dig site wants to get checked out at McMurdo. Hey, McMurdo, that's a real place. Drone? Question mark sites? Uh, funny. Funny, funny. Okay. I mean, shit's abandoned, busted down, whatever. Oh, here. This is the, the prototype Ansible, right? <clears throat> I guess we learned from opening cutscene. Let's have a look around. Oh, okay. That just drops us down here again. No, 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 I want to climb up there. I want to climb up and look around. I know this is only, like, narrative opening tutorial area, but I want to see what's up here. Oh, it's just a vent. Okay, fine, whatever. Oh, did we have a, a drop through there? I think we did, down in A. Yeah, okay. They haven't had a chance to teach us about that yet. We're ahead of the curve. Okay, a big red lit up switch. This is probably the power, huh? Zroop. Yep, look at that. Everything's got power suddenly. We have awakened planet Zebus. I mean, Antarctica. Message on the Ansible screen. Sure is. Let's see what we got. The secret door past the three bookshelves on floor one. Okie dokie. Who is this? Why did you send me here? I don't know. No response. Okay, play your game for now. I guess that's us. That's us talking to ourselves. Very true to life. Uh, secret door past the three bookshelves. Here, right? Oh, hey, look at that. Yeah, that's, that's a pretty secret door. That blended right in. That's a good secret. Did we have the, the Mega Man style room transitions too? We sure did. Oh, I love that. I love that so much. Okay. Big ass cargo elevator. Presumably. Oh, oh, whoa, oh, jeez. <laughs> Man, somebody needs to check that elevator. I think it's a little glitchy. That's uh, funny as hell. Okay, so now, did that actually move us, or did that, like, glitch us forward or backward in time? Okay, it might have actually moved us. This, this room looks different. It's gonna break the hell out of every box we see, because there's something of value inside, which would almost certainly be destroyed. That sounds like that's gonna be a secret door there. I guess we'll find out. Oh wait, maybe we did hop back in time or something, because this looks to be roughly the same spot. Or maybe not, maybe we just went down a bunch of- DO NOT ENTER! Good advice, I'm not gonna take it. <laughs> okay. Oh, sick, we can do some- oh, we've got eight- oh well, we've got five-way attack, I guess. And angle up and do vertical? Damn, that's sick. Alright. Oh. Ground. Ground should not be shaking. Ground should be the most stable there is. It should never shake. That's why earthquakes are kind of frightening. Because then the most stable ground is just suddenly shaking all over the place. Oh, have you come back for me? I don't know. Who, who, who dis? New person, who dis?
Hmm. Okay. Uh, they're a little bit further down, apparently. Oh no, we got some creepy artifact ruin shit already. Hmm. I don't know if I like that. That's not a good sign. Have a look around. Oh, hey, it's another Ansible terminal. What's that here? Ooh, I like how the minimap is lightly textured. It's not just a bunch of hollow boxes. That's neat. That's very cool. That's a nice touch. Oh, oh boy. No, ground should not be shaking. Stop that. Ooh, a pendant. Yoink! Oh, it's a compass. Whatever. Lapis lazuli pendant that is lit up on one side, as if pointing like a compass. <laughs> I guess it's a compass. All right. <clears throat> you find a compass? Good. You can use it to locate me. Okay. C cool, I guess. I mean, just follow the, the pointy blue light, I suppose, right? Look, it's telling me to go left and slightly down. Oh, shit. Uh, that's gonna hurt. Oh, and also very cold. Burr. Yeah, no shit it's freezing. It's Antarctica. I see a pot or an urn? No. <laughs> like, what do you mean? I don't see shit. Oh, God. That has got to be real cold. Interesting swim cycle there going on. Eh. Uh, eh. Yeah. Oh, shaky ground again. That's not good. Oh, shit. Water's rising? Is it? Oh yeah, it is, I guess. Look for the urn, it'll help. Okay, um... Oh, um... Okay, well I would love to look for the urn, but... Oh there, there it is. Yeah, I see it, but I can't get to it. Alright, I'm a... I'm a drown, I guess. Cause I can't... I can't swim down, I can't dive. Yeah, I'm a drown right here. Credits roll, and that's the end of Axiom Verge 2. All right. <laughs> Oof. Not a good way to go. This is where it ends. Well, no, clearly not. I guess it's just as well. <laughs> Whoa, okay. A little, a little dark already. Ah, I see. I guess in Axiom Verge 1, we kind of died immediately too, right? And then we respawned somewhere weird, and then it was all weird and shit, right? Able to rebuild me. Okay, good, cool. Am I still the same person, though? So what the hell are you? I don't know. Arm, an intelligent collection of machines, and a part of you now. Oh, good, yeah, there's always a catch. There's always a catch to the whole respawning thing, isn't there? Ah, shit. <laughs> uh, Mashalama, it's an honor to have a new wielder. Okay. Gotta get out of here. Somebody can get this thing out of me. Yeah, that's that's a pretty human reaction to have. Like, ah, damn. Weird living ass machines and shit. That's not good. Alright, okay. So we've got save points at the weird chalice things. Alright. Got it. Got it. Ooh. Oh no. Why is there always a bird? Birds are jerks. Is this bird gonna be a jerk? Alright, yeah, get the fuck out of here, bird. He's shit. Alright. Uh, okay. Well, definitely places that are uh, unassailable until we get some movement options, I guess. Oh no. We got weirdo electro scorpions down there too. Those don't look native to the area. They're probably not friendly. So fuck you. <laughs> Gonna go out on a limb and say that the weird glowy scorpions are not our friend. No, you didn't see shit. Fuck off. You didn't see shit. Go away. No, no. You didn't see nothing. Can't see me. I am gray and the background is also gray. Fuck off, weird scorpion thing. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, fuck you. Alright. 
very least we're not completely defenseless, right? We got this sick ice axe. And also they seem to be pretty harmless the way it is. <laughs> very good. Oh, there's a glowy green thing up there. <clears throat> oh, there were drones. Okay. I guess that makes sense. Sent by Lamasu. Oh, hey, Lamasu. That's a name drop from Axiom Verge 1, I think. Sort of machine designed to protect against interlopers. It's likely that what destroyed your people's settlement. Oh, really? What the fuck's going on? Who knows? I want that green thing up there. Too bad I can't get it. I'll need some manner of probably double jam to get up there. Or go around or something, right? That's how these games work. Alright. Oh, look at you. Oh, ow. Alright, presumably we'll get some sort of projectile weapon soon, because that's definitely a switch. That red orb is definitely a switch. If I'm remembering my Axiom Verge 1. Okay, they have health drops, red orb shit, okay. Oh, oh, ow, hey, oh, oh, got the blue beams. Fuck you. Yeah, try it, let's try it. Alright. Oh, good, water. We didn't just die in water or anything. New body is too dense to float. However, you no longer need to breathe. Oh, hey, okay, you know what? That's a pretty good trade-off, I think. Not gonna do the whole Sonic situation here, right? <laughs> it's gets weird, what the hell did she do to me? Well, apparently we're part machine now or something, right? Oh. We're too dense to float, but we don't need to breathe. And I guess we can't go here at all, because we can't jump high enough to get over there, and we apparently cannot grip onto ledges and shit. <laughs> cool party's a little awkward. I know, but think of what a cool party trick that is, though. Like, you can challenge anyone to a contest who can hold their breath the longest, and you fucking win by default. You pull in some pretty good cash. Ooh. Get a boomerang? Is our projectile gonna be a boomerang? Oh, sorry, a gishru. Similar to a boomerang, <laughs> but glistening with nano machines. Oh boy. Doesn't seem all that glistening, but all right, we'll we'll accept it. It's funny as hell. All right, well, we know immediately where we want to use this, right? I mean, aside from bopping this shithead. Ow! Is that switch over on the left, yeah. Can we throw it down? We can throw it down, too. That's rad. All right. Does this have the uh, Mega Man Metal Gear Syndrome here with the 8-way? Sure as fuck does. That's rad. Oh boy, yeah, what is that? Oh, jeez, okay. Tunnel drills and shit, huh? Ow. Oh, what was this? It interacts. Oh, we gotta break it. We gotta break shit. What the heck did we just absorb? Improved climbing ability. Grasp ledges. Okay, all right. It's the power grip. Shishkala, thank you for freeing me from my slumber and also breaking my urn. Wasn't expensive or anything. Don't worry about it. Arms are many. Well, there's Shishkala can help you surmount high ledges. Ha, hilarious. Haha. -ha. Oh, yeah, it's literally just... Oh, I see. And then there's little outcroppings here. Damn. 
Wish I had the upper body strength to do that. <laughs> That's pretty cool. I mean, I can hang on a ledge like nobody's business, but climbing up, climbing up them, kind of a little bit tough. A little bit tough for a, a old man such as me. They're a bit tougher. They take three swings instead of two. All right, that's still unassailable. But now we can get places. We can get places that are slightly higher. Ow! Oh, jeez. Excuse me. And now we are almost dead. Oh, good. That's the low health beep. Oh, no. That's not going to be annoying at all. Okay, good. At least the volume decreases. That's nice. Oh, and now we are dead. I don't know, that could be considered a tactical death, right? Pulls us back here. Presumably we still have our ledge grab ability, right? Oh yeah, we sure do. Yoink. Another bar of health. Oh man. This habitat got all fucked up. But this is where we came out of, yeah? Yeah. Do we have an actual map map? Oh, here we go. There's our map map. Hmm. I think the weird glitch elevator is busted, huh? Unfortunate. But what are you gonna do? Alright, so which... Okay, we can't grab, like, weird background ledges. I guess it's gotta be, like, a solid... A solid block or something, yeah? I guess that makes sense. Fuck you, bird. Get out of here. <laughs> All right, that's still unassailable. That requires like a real double jump for that. <laughs> yeah, I wonder what happened to our weird like generic ass helicopter guard dude. He's probably just chilling, reading a comic book or something. Never gets a day of vacation. So he's probably happy that we're taking our time. What do we got here? It's another busta thing here? It sure is. I'm going to your powers and abilities by one point. Apply within the skills menu. Okay. Skills menu. Oh, hey, look at this. Oh, shit. Look at this. Additional 50 health points. Okay. Melee damage. Melee speed. Range damage. Projectile speed. Damn. I don't know if I want to spend that just yet. Not sure what I want to commit to. What kind of build do we want to commit to out the gate here? We'll just let that, we'll let that skill point set for a moment. Although melee damage might not be a bad investment. That looks like a morph ball asshole right there, doesn't it? We'll be back. We'll be back when we can roll into a ball. Or have our little mobility drone thing like we did in Axe and Verge 1, I guess, yeah? Oh, that was a plant, okay. Tunes. Music is pretty fucking good already. I not say that much. Because we're technically in a different area? Oh no, we're still the overworld, quote unquote. 
Oh, you didn't see shit. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Kind of pretty. I don't know if I believe that there's a hot spring in the Ar Antarctic, though. Seems a little strange. Ow! Hey! You! Bathtub battleship bullshit. Oh! Feels a little bad to have a little shocky bit underwater, but hey. What do I know? Oh, that looked like it was something up there. Oh no. We'll need the ability to swim at some point. Or get it like a an inflatable inner tube or something. <laughs> Probably the incorrect direction. Oh shit! Ow, motherfucker! That was weird. Oh, it's a save point though. This will save in the, the space that we shouldn't be in. Hey, come here, come here, you. Come on. Ah, uh, yeah, no, 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 no. Come on. Yeah. That's what I thought. Uh, down to my superior. Uh, what do we do with this now, though? Can we pick it up? It's not interactable. Set reminders? Oh, okay. It's basic map marking. Oh, I see. Lake Amagi. That's where we are. Alright. Weirdo glowy canister. We'll wait for another day, I suppose. Oh, look at that big motherfucker. Uh, maybe don't want to deal with that right now. Feel like we might be a bit outclassed at the moment. Let's go say hi anyways, though. You know, just to be neighborly. Oh, but we probably can't, because we can't get up there. Boo. little swim. Got to know the local aquatic life a little bit. Yeah, come get you. Come get you some. Ow. All right. We should probably get to what we're actually supposed to be doing here. Probably following our handy dandy compass. Oh, and going into this thing that we never went into. We just kind of walked right past it, huh? Oh, hey, this looks nice. What do we got here? Dear Ernest, I know you will probably never have the chance to read this. I'm writing for my own sanity. Happy to be. I am happy here. Looking back, it is hard to believe I ever worried so much about all the bullshit of the. Was there more? Or did I just kind of skip by that? Okay, there was more. <laughs> I was so worried about. Much so much about all the bullshit of the real, real world. <laughs> Work, rent, taxes, the stupid rat race, hell yeah. I'm with whoever's writing this. It was hard at first, but now I'm actually glad they destroyed the stupid freight elevator. <laughs> freight elevator, right, okay. I didn't think the Antarctic job paid enough, and probably by now you're thinking you were right, but what you never will understand is that whether or not I ever see home again, the decision was still mine, and that alone makes it worth it to me. 
Augusta. Hell yeah, Augusta. Fucking speak truth. Speak the truth there. I'm with you. It's important to be able to make your own decisions. That's good shit. That's the good shit right there. Oh, hey, and a person. Uh, a, a person person, not a weird, like, nano machine person? Uh, hi. <laughs> God, I thought I was alone here. I just fell upon our special freight elevator. It's a gift that keeps giving. I mean, special is one way to, to, to describe it, I suppose. One-way ticket. Since we're still trapped here. Oh, boy. Trapped where? Yeah, exactly. That's what I want to know. The locals. Sagiga? Sagiga? Sagija? I don't know. Whatever. Call this place Gin Gear. It's a different universe from Earth. Different universe? Holy shit. Okay. Dr. Hammond built the portal here, but was afraid of what would happen if anyone found out. Damn. Disappeared years ago, so we can't ask her. Turns out the locals were the machines, I guess. Didn't really like us poking around. Not many of us survived. But I did, mysteriously enough. Just an archaeologist. The site manager, Warren, is up at the observatory trying to build, build a portal going back. Where's that? Probably up at the top of the mountain. Yeah, hey, look at that. <clears throat> Listen, we gotta be honest. We tried a hundred different ways to get back and nothing works. Be prepared for failure. Ah, oh, man. If that ain't a mood. Ender Chowdery, I'll reverse engineer and build the portal myself if I have to. I mean, okay. I should be more optimistic. It's just hard with everyone gone. It's Malka, by the way. Let's see. Okay, Malka. Very good. We have uh, made contact with another organic. Malka. What can you tell me about the ruins? They look like it came from ancient Mesopotamia, but according to radiocarbon dating. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Slow it down. I'm a CEO, not a scientist. A few hundred years newer. Huh. Interesting. Virgin to evolution. How improbable is that? Pretty improbable. Not impossible, though. I think Hammond knew she didn't know what was going on, or she's probably long dead. I mean, she's only been gone a couple of years. She might still be alive. Who knows? We'll count her out just yet until you find her body. Alright, what do we got here? More notes. <clears throat> Companies lays off thousands, turn profit. Oh, man. If this isn't a note from 2022. Oh, only 2044. Very good. Its millions are plunging into poverty. The economic crisis was ne has nevertheless surfaced a clear winner. Big business. Oh, boy. Things haven't changed in the 22 years, have they? Uh, so, collectively cutting more than 300,000 workers, 47 of the top 50 public traded companies posted a profit this quarter. Oh, boy. Either we eliminate 10% this year or 100% next year, said CEO Indra Chaudhary. Hey, wait a minute. That's us. Wait a minute. Seemingly tone deaf to the plight of thousands of Globe 3 employees laid off since the onset of the crisis in 2043. Well, okay. Company raked in profits of 232 billion since then. You know, that's not really a lot of money. 22 years in the future, probably. So I'm kind of tepid on this one. But still, you know, cutting 300,000 jobs is it's, it's a big number. It's a big number of jobs. Oh, hey, it's a, it looks like a fully functional something. What do we got here? Must enter an upstream port. Your daughter depends on you. Ugh. Who are you? No response. Running out of memory. Go to telescope. Next. Sector 23-3. Okay. Alright, we'll just break another urn and get another weirdo power, right? Double jump? Please tell me it's double jump. Let's see, charge up melee attacks. Huh? All right, that's cool too, I guess. Cool. We get a little sparkly doodle on our uh, on our ice axe. Great. <laughs> okay, what was was it twenty three three or something, right? Okay, so we have to climb. All the way up here. Oh, it's marked on our map. Very good. Looking like some straight up normal ass buildings here. Hammond Corpus, record losses. Blah, blah, blah. 2049, 422 p.m. Eastern Time. Hammond Corpus lost a record 57 billion. That's a pretty big amount of money to lose. 
In the fiscal year ending in March, the company announced that it was the fifth straight year the company finished with a loss. A restructuring plan was announced to Elon Elizabeth Hans, promising to cut the volume of Ansible's produced. The beleaguered executive has been criticized in recent years of being out of touch when discussing her future vision of the tech, often focusing on unrelated projects such as the five billion dollar that's not a lot of money actually, government contract to support research at Jones Station Antarctica. Huh. I mean, great that they're supporting research in Antarctica, that sounds good. But five billion really isn't a lot of money if you think about it. For something like that. Okay, we got weirdo tiny drones flying around. Oh cool, I want that. Gimme. Can I use my boomerang to collect it? I can't. Ah, oh, boo! Ah, oh, we can't uh, crawl either, so um, let's come back there. We'll need the crawl ability to get that one. Hmm. Some sort of door switch mechanism. In a different area already? No, we're still in Mount Ibi. Oh, this is a bustable wall if ever I've seen one, but not with our current equipment, apparently. All right, need some manner of explosives, I'm sure. Oh, okay, those are hostile. Fuck you. Fuck you again, and a third time. Oh, hey, ow! Ah! Of course, my most damaging weapon is a melee weapon that I can't beat him with from this distance. Sure, they won't let me get down here, huh? Yeah, can't destroy that. Can't get what looks to be an upgraded axe. Nuts. Oh, hey. Oh, that's too close there. Stop it. Back off. Personal space, man. Oh, that mechanized owls, too? Man, what kind of nature hasn't been weaponized? Ugh. Oh, stop. Oh. Oh, well. Toast. Oh, don't mind me, just phasing back together from a cloud of nanomachines, probably. Malka seems unfazed. Sees it all the time, probably. Presumably we need just need to climb up to that green spot on our map anyways. Oh hey, look, the switch. Maybe. Unpressable. Alright, so maybe we need like a, a totem or an idol or a weight or something to put on there to, to hit that, perhaps? getting a La Mulana-ish vibe from it, which is uh, perhaps neither good nor bad. <laughs> oh, damn. All right, he blew up. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on. Oh, shit. Hell yeah. Play fucking ping pong with our boomerang. That's sick. Huh. Neat. Yeah, try to jump up here, idiot. Oh shit, he jumped up here. <laughs> oh no, it's weird mecha owl. Ow! Yeah, no, no, you didn't see sh Oh, yeah, good. Put yourself into a corner, that'll help. Yeah. 
I am still faster though, so haha. Yeah. <laughs> oh, there's a save point right here. Great, perfect. That also recharges us, that's cool. Got Zeppelins too? Oh jeez. Electro Zeppelins. Wild. Oh, okay, apparently this is uh, written in not English. The exalted Lamasu, our lord, has given us the divine plan plans of the ancient king. The blacksmith and cast weapons of great terror, powered by the strength of fire. We may have built these for use against the fearsome Udug, but have only been able to test them on our enemies in neighboring Irikar. Still, I fear it is not long before Irikar too masters of forbidden knowledge. And then what? The Udug arrived to find us at each other's throats. One wonders, one wonders then what? Blah, 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 blah. Okay. All right. Got some, uh, some war shit going on, naturally. I don't necessarily want to save, I just wanted to refill, but hey, that's, that works too. Oh, hey, what the... Okay, weirdo door, weirdo switch, weirdo rolling thing. That was gonna be a, a non starter as far as uh, crossing that. What are we out here? Okay, that's the second thing that's busted. Can we do anything with this? Weird. No, I guess it's just the canister off the enemy, but I wonder if that means anything. We'll find out eventually. Hey, look at that very conspicuously glowing mine of some sort. Yeah, look at that shit. There's another thing down there. Was that a doored off? That was doored off. What do we got? Oh, it's the probably the door to go down, huh? Hmm. Huh? Oh. Oh, I- Oh, oh geez, they're in two parts. Oh, that's no good. Fucking... Oh, I see, because then the canister above him is something, is what drops off before. Okay, 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 I get it. Oh, oh, here we go. Hell yeah. Pink nanomachines this time. What do we get? Bomb? How's he infect enemies and objects to modify their behavior? Ooh. That sounds weird. Oh, I see. Oh! Neat. Uh, yeah. Activate. Oh, okay, I see. We have activated a platform. Uh, no, come back, though. Thank you. Also got another meter of 300 up there. Presumably is my weirdo nano powers or whatever. Oh, hey, what's this? Oh, that's to refill our ship. Okay. Oh, cool. Can I, uh, be like, hey, buddy, can you explode for me, please? Also, how do I... There. No, no, this one. Here. Oh, uh, did it... I did do a thing. Okay, uh, that... Oh, I see. Flow, detonate, become an ally. Oh, but we can't, because we're only level one... We're only level one on the hack, I guess. All right, that kaboom. Interesting. Okay. I see. I see. Huh. Neat. 
All right, there's our button manipulation. Fine, this it means I didn't make it. Warren asked me to head to Jonestown for help. The drones are all over the mountain and put up a bunch of gates. You can't even get to the Euro Camp now. Oh, well, we'll see about that. Never stopped nobody before, has it? I guess it has. Stop that person. But it won't stop us. Oh shit, look at that thing. It's like half of a chimera with robo legs. Ow! Oh, uh, slow down. But we can't, because we're not level two. Shit. Oh, no. Oh, ow. Oh. Okay. Maybe that direction is the wrong direction to go. Let's go this direction instead. Where it's not as dangerous. Presumably. Oh, this might just take us down the other side of the area here. Oh, but this is cool. More notes. Criminal Breakthrough 1. And, as you know, the whole purpose of the elevator is to allow us to pass safely across the breach from one world to another. The breach itself is a kind of world, albeit one with a, such a differing fundamental structure that it's not survivable for humans. Or, for that matter, digital cameras, microphones, and various other electronics we've tried to observe it with. <clears throat> However, it may not surprise you to learn that certain analog clocks can make the transition mostly unscathed. For the most part, they operate normally, but the rate at which they operate is different than on Earth. Or Kingear, which is presumably where we are right now. Not only that, the rate changes. It might appear to move at a quarter speed for several days and then spend a full week moving at 100th speed. Damn. Time dilation. Alright. Shit's getting weirder. That's cool. Alright, can we make this guy... Hey, no, 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 come back here, buddy. There you go. Good for you. Uh, oh, no. Maybe we could trick him into blowing open this wall for us. Not happening. Alright. So thus far, we've gained... Corner hang, and... Hack slash manipulate and two weapons slash tools. Seems pretty good progress so far. Oh hey, look at that fucker. Oh, that looks dangerous as hell. Um Oh, that's our health beeping that's getting more urgent for some reason. Why though? There we go. Uh platform. Yeah, there we go. Oh bonk. <laughs> Alright, where's the nearest save point? It's back at camp there. You know what? We're gonna go grab that real quick, because that beeping is gonna... It's gonna grind on my nerves, and I don't need my nerves being ground upon. Which hand gave me a receiver too, so there must be a tape nearby, right? That's funny. Man, yeah, Receiver 2 is a fun game, too. Go back to that one. Apparently there are mods for it, as well, in the Steam community thing, or whatever. Yeah, check those out sometime. Alright, so what can we do here? We can't bust our way through there, because that's all blocked to hell, right? We can... I guess we can try to climb a little bit further that way. Oh no, we can open that door over there. We got our weird hack powers, right? Ow. Right. Got the bows. Forgot that they exploded. Ow! Uh, can we do anything with you? No, 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 come back here. Ah, hey, you little shit.
Oh no. Oh no, the weirdo uh, owl thing. I don't want to tangle with that. Okay, alright. Where's the other safe? The other safe point. <laughs> right, yeah, the Glock 17's not having safeties is kind of, uh... Leads to a lot of accidents, it seems, huh? <laughs> Ah, oh, crap. Can I get close enough to... to hit that? Sure can't. Something with these guys? It detonates from even slight impacts. And it's healing nanites. Detonates or explodes. Alright. Uh, detonate, please. Kaboom. What about the platform on which it resides, though? This is its cargo. Oh, I see. It's holding something. Ah. I see. It's not aware that that was, uh... Oh. Well, that being the case, then... Would that count as an explosive that we could... bust open some walls with, maybe? scary lion chimera thing, right? Maybe tweak our way past it here? No, no, you didn't see shit. Stop. Yeah, fine. Oh no, okay. Preserve state across screen transitions. That's weird. Ah, crap. Oh, alright. Excuse me. <laughs> that crap. That! <laughs> Spooked me into falling down. Okay, good. It's down here now. Oh no. It's down here now. <laughs> See ya. target as well. That's cool. Oh, we can get can boomerang shit. Probably just the free-floating health stuff, though. Explore at our leisure that weird chimera thing is down. Ha! Ah, loser. Oh, there's another one though. Uh. Uh oh. Eh? Yeah. Ah! Ha <laughs> ha! Gotcha, idiot. <laughs> Hate to see it. That's a good idea. Whoa, hey, whoa, what's up with this? Target swarms and attacks these enemies. Oh, that's cool. That's neat. What else can I hack here? Anything? Hm. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Uh, 
Ah. Oh, look at that motherfucker. Uh, okay. That's a boss if ever I've seen one. Oh, and also that's glitchy as hell, huh? Hmm. Alright. Ah, figures. Okay. Oh, jeez! <laughs> it remembered me. Oh, no. Oh, don't you even. Yeah. Yeah, you want some? Ah, again, slow, overload, overload, oh, that's fun, overheat, hell yeah, oh yeah, fucking eat shit, you don't like that very much at all, do you? Oh. We did it, fuck off, we beat a huge ass thing that we... Seemed like we didn't have any fucking reason that we should have been able to beat that thing. Alright, what do we get? Oh, another power point thing that we're maybe not gonna spend immediately. <laughs> oh. This. Ow! Besides being harmful, apparently. Air launch a remote drone, which you may detonate at any time to return Indra. Okay, so here's our little remote drone thing from Max and Verge 1, right? <laughs> Your kid? Dumb. At the end of the war, they thought maybe kids would make better arms. Uh, well, that's weird. Like I said, ever since. Sorry. Maybe the youngest of the arms, his powers can still be of use. He was trapped in a jar for all this time, and all you can think about is how useful- Yeah, that's kind of- mm. On your hand, I can make a ball out of it. Throw it and see what happens. Uh, all right. Oh, right. See? I'm supposed to be able to turn you into a giant beast. This is pretty good too, right? I mean, uh, sure. Try and go through that storm portal. No other arm can do that. Oh, it's a storm portal now, huh? All right. Whoa, weird. Whoa, weird. Uh huh? <laughs> it's all lo fi and shit. I like it. This is so adorable. Can we ride the- oh, okay, we can't ride the thing. Can we climb walls? Can we double jump? Can we use our hack thing? We can. I would like to hack not this, apparently. Save. Oh, I see. Oh, yeah. All right. The the, the room transitions from Max in Verge One. Cool. Cool shit. Ah, oh, it's so cool. The music is such a banger too. Ah, uh, I like this game. Oop. Easy. Cool, so can we see- oh yeah, look at this. So now it's like a whole nother- it's like a backside of the field, hmm. Alright. Wild. Oh, I see, now we're up here. Okay. Okay, I, I see what's happening. Oh, except I don't want to do that, do I? Oh, I guess I do, because then I want to get my main body up there, huh? Yeah, we did it. Uh, what was the thing? The button? There we go. Neat. Cool shit. Uh, 
Now I kind of want, I want to go like bonk. There we go. Oh, I see. Did that mirror what we were just in, maybe? Oh no, but it's another little PowerPoint thing. Neat. Okay, so now we've got something what which can go in the narrow spaces. As expected. Very good. Through shit, huh? Ah, scouting out ahead. All right, so two weirdo hats. <laughs> oh, hey! Ow. Leave tiny, cute drone alone. What has he ever done to you? Here, yeah. Can't do anything with, huh? Oh, I see. Can't. Can't shoot that far as our little tiny man just yet. here. Oh, I see. We're just back to where we were. Oh yeah, <laughs> literally that's where we are. That's funny. Okay, I don't know what that got us besides a little bit of recon. little place. It's so comfy. Oh, and another flesh and blood human being, maybe? Is this Warren? Excuse me. Ah, newcomer. Name's Warren. Hey, we guessed right. Site manager. I didn't even get here. The mountain's crawling with robots. It was, it was, it was a little bit, of, little bit of a fight. We took down a weird big eagle drone thing. <laughs> Being better at swinging an ice axe. Ninja Trattery, I hear you're building a portal back home. Neat, well, a slight problem. You see the portal is based on Ansible technology from Dr. Hammond. Dr. Hammond hasn't been around for a few years, right? A specific Ansible, one of the originals made back in 2007. It was stolen by the Kazakhs. Alright, drone station run by the Americans. Well, it is, was a private effort. The US government didn't know about the portal, yeah, naturally. Some researchers from nearby Zagimbayev station discovered what we were doing. In exchange for their silence, we let them through. Oh, yeah, that's a good fucking plan. Do they have a portal? <laughs> I don't know if they're even still alive. They didn't even stay in contact. The research station somewhere south of us, if you can figure out how to get there. Like, south-south or video game south? Because video game south is down. <laughs> she just led with that. Okay. That was this place. It almost looks like a tube. Some form of an adjacent universe where the laws of physics differ. Clear air chemistry and biology transfer here, but gravity does not seem to be driven by mass. This telescope to find out more. It's as if we're inside a torus the size of a planetarium. 
planetary orbit. Hmm, interesting. It's not fully solid, it's more like a lattice. We can see through some of the openings and behind them, it's just more lattice. We don't know what keeps it from collapsing in on itself. Well, that's weird. How'd you build a portal leading here when you don't even know what here is? I don't know. <laughs> Magic? Physics? Both? It's all Dr. Hammond. She always seemed to have some insight the rest of us weren't privy to. Hmm. Yeah, cool. Weird secret knowledge. That's, the. Uh, that's good. Okay, I guess we are in a telescope. Uh, Alright, we're up here at the telescope. Maybe we're there? Data throttling has resulted in input overflow. Okay, yeah. <clears throat> Millions are trapped in detention. It's ansible, it's old. Nothing I can do about that. Alright, terminal running low, trying to condense info. Oh good, yeah. It's... Start dropping vowels left, right, and center. We'll still make sense of it. Clifftown, sector 1416. Are we just on, like, some gigantic-ass fetch quest here? That's what it's feeling like. If I like that. But alright, what was it? 14-16? Where the heck are we? It's the breach. Interior something. Breach. Oh, we can't. Oh, I see. Have to go outside to check our map. Yeah, it's blah 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 blah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Alright, you got two things. Two things to say, and we've heard them both. Submarine progress. Yeah, the Kazakhstan demand for half a dozen submarines. You're not going to like it. It's inside, put me in contact with laid off employees of a Russian military contractor who claim they can disassemble the vessels, fit the pieces into the freight elevator, and then reassemble them on the other side. Really? That sounds like a pretty bold claim. Of course, we haven't revealed yet the real reasons we are doing this, but we're going to have to eventually. And the cost for all this, plus their silence, roughly $220 million altogether. Oh, that's fucking chump change. Not including the cost of the subs themselves. Okay, that's a little bit more expensive. If you're okay with this, let me know and I'll make it happen. Andre. Very good. Oh, shit. Oh. Okay. Excuse me. No, no, no. Oh, he's... Ow. Oh, they're not that tough. It's like four swings. Ow. Oh, four swings and then not too many, uh, boomerang hits thereafter, huh? Alright. Oh, right. Now check the map and see. What was it? Like, 14 whatever? Oh, it's all the way the fuck over there. Alright, well, no matter. keeps getting weirder and weirder, but that's all right. Like, well, when you cross into a parallel universe, then shit's allowed to get weird. Or I guess we don't know it's a parallel universe, but we know it's a universe that's different than the one we're used to. All right, let's go. Whee! Ow! Oh wait, actually, can we uh, commandeer you for a sec here? No. All right, how about healing? Yeah, there we go. Oh. Never mind, we did. <laughs> I wonder if we could have made that jump onto that uh, onto that platform, though. I guess we can try it again, huh? It's almost no penalty for dying. Oh wait, hold on a second. That's all glitchy and shit. Is that supposed to be all glitchy and shit? Oh, I guess that's where we reappeared from the breach, right? Oh, that's not gonna get us there. Uh, can I, uh... pop a thing? Another cargo. Oh, excuse me.
Oh, I wonder if, uh... Can our, can our little drone boy, like, literal drone boy, do anything with that? Here's not. Hmm. Nuts. All right, we've got some skill points that we can use, right? Oh, here we go. Uh, infection level. Nano points? That's okay. So it's NP then. <laughs> infection speed. Infection range. Okay. Melee damage. Melee speed. Interesting. Alright. Well, you know what? I would prefer perhaps to beef up my own... My own stuff before we... Concentrate on other things. So let's go... Do the damages, and then melee attack speed. There we go. Pretty balanced. Oh shit, now we can swing double speed and probably do more damage, right? Yeah, eat shit. Alright. Oh. Bummer of a cracked wall there. Can't get up there, that's all blocked off. Uh, can we climb up there? Doubtful. Hell yeah! Oh! <laughs> oh wait, wait just a tick. Uh, could we have gotten that guy to roll on down here and destroy... Not that. Swarmed the hell out of something. I don't know what they were going after. I don't remember if this is a place that we can climb up or not. Probably not. Eh, figures. Less. Nope. Nuts. Hmm. Okay, guess we go back down the mountain and see what we can see. the big boss fight arena, right? Oh, wait, there's a little thing up there. Oh, is the audio being squiffy again? Yeah, sorry. <laughs> okay, how's that? That looks better. Uh, one of these days, I'll sit down and figure out why the F it's doing that. Today is not that day. Unfortunately, but oh well. Um, it was just like literally right here. Yeah, all right. Give me that health. Did that actually increase? My that doesn't look like it increased my health. Maybe it did. I guess. Can we, do we have to actually use them? 
guess not. Top right corner was accessible by sort of human nano machine us, was it? Like we can do that, and it's fine, but that doesn't get us anything. Besides a little path down here, right? But this was just a skill point, I think. Yeah. Alright, that's fine. Ah, crap. I don't want to have to... I'm going to have to do this again. Alright, fine. Hit the platform thing to, to do the other thing, right? There's at least a couple things we can get on our way down the mountain, I suppose, right? At least one little health bip. That was in a tiny tunnel or whatever. And maybe a couple other things we can investigate. All the way there, over there. Okay. Dudes are hardly scary at all. Kind of get up in their grill and use our our powers of fast ice axe swing. To take them down. Oh right, wasn't there? Yeah, there's a thing with this. It's like, hey, I want to ride right on you. Thank you. Uh, can you move? Can we make that jump? <laughs> we can. Incredible. All right. Oh, hey, look at that. Yoink. Oh, it's a fragment. Okay. Alright, that's... Stops him from attacking us, that's fine. Nothing really else of value though, it seems. Um, looks like there's a safe point. It's down by Melka already? Yeah, son of a bitch. A lot faster to climb down the mountain than it is to climb up. So that tracks. Ah, there's a little health thing over there though. If memory serves. Be remiss not to go get it whilst we're in the neighborhood, you know? Oh, it's just a little tiny fragment. Well. Uh, okay, well, so we're kind of already over where we need to be anyway. Oh, there's this whole bit that we needed a thing for. That we now have a thing for. Hmm. Curious. Okay. Oh, 
Hey, those guys look familiar. A little creepy. Matrix. Let's see, store and use healing energy from power cells dropped by enemies. Oh, that's cool. So it uh, makes more sense than our uh, flashlight for now, right? Okay. Oops, probably shouldn't have. Too late. fuck over here C cool cool I guess cool uh, take oh oh I see this is gonna be our little thingamadink that's gonna be our method of destroying walls we uh, absorb the explodey power and then we unleash it interesting okay I guess I can get down with that. Like, uh, so. Or, no? Oh, does it have to be in the drone? No? How does... How do we... <laughs> what? <laughs> How do we now use this thing? How does it store and use heal... Oh, healing energy. Damn it! I don't want to use healing energy. Boo! Ah. I thought it was going to do an explode and let us through here. Guess I should have read that a bit close. A little bit more closely. Huh? Oops. My bad. I was getting excited for the explodies too, but it appears to have been a false hope. Unfortunate. Oh, uh, excuse me. Alright, yeah, that's it. Okay. Important axe looking motherfucker over here, but still unknown as to how to get it. Probably gotta explode these somehow. I'm not certain on how to do that. Can't just hack this open to, to do it, can we? No. Bummer. Well, there might have been another path in the little breach zone thing, right? Let's go check that out. gonna be a secret wall too at some point that just looks like it screams fucking secrety secret tell you what maybe we break it down with our drone no okay never mind I 
not hack this guy? No. It's organic and unhackable. How about this guy? No? Available switches for now. Oh, and I can't bust my drone to. So wait, can I not? Can I die here and? Okay. Oh, and it just responds to me back there. Interesting. Okay. Huh. Wild. Alright. So it's like another little... Another little game in, in and of itself. That's okay. Alright. So what, that just pulls us back up here, which isn't terribly useful, I guess. It's not like there's a narrow... Is there a narrow path here? No, it's an exploding wall. Okay, what do we got? So there's still stuff down at the lake, maybe, that we can do? Did we have our edge grippy powers down there? I think we did. I think that's where we got them, right? Maybe not. Hmm. Well, let's go take a look. have a swim. <sighs> save. Been a while since we saved last, I think. Might be able to, yeah, because we could always do that in Axiom Bridge 1 as well. It's like toss our drone thing whilst we're in the middle of a jump. Uh, we might not be able to actually get up that high though. Maybe we might. Yeah. 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 Get off. Oh. oh, and then it's. It doesn't protect me when I'm in drone form like it did otherwise. Ah, crap, I do will do. Yep, you go. <laughs> Alright, I don't know that that's gonna work the way I want it to. Yep, ah. <laughs> okay. So, clearly not what they want me to do, right? Clearly not. Clearly not. Oh. Well, oh, I see. It's taken me before, I think. Yeah. Is this a door? Oh, that's clearly a door, but we can't open. It. Can't open underwater doors. Might be a. Ow! Ow! Might be a power we unlock later. Oh, she what the? Oh, come on! Fucking mimic ass bricks. Ah oh, shit, we're all the way back up here now. Ah, it won't matter. Now we know. We have we have done a learn. They did us an educate, and now we have done a learn, and now we know what's about to happen. should have done is hit the save point before we uh, wiggled our butts any further here, right? Huh, wait a minute. Uh, that's a canister thing that, oh, what the, oh, that hurts, okay, very good. I 
I would like to destroy this thing without hitting the thing on top, probably. That's my goal here. There we go. Because I want... I want that canister. I want to use my power matrix thing to absorb the canister and see what it does. Oh, I bet it's just na Is it nano juice? It's just nano juice, right? Oh no, it is health. Interesting. Okay. Um, that's cool, I guess. Kind of worthless since the save point is right here, but uh, whatever. All right. So we had ourselves a learn, right? We've learned that there are are bricks full of enemies. They seem to be either slightly off color from normal bricks, right? Oh, excuse me. Ow! Oh, oh, jeez. Okay. Ow! No! Oh, balls. Oh, no. Things have gone extremely wrong. Ow! They're very dark since we're underwater. Ow! Not. Okay, I guess we'll just uh, explore this way, that's fine. Oh, there's a breach up there, that's why. Somewhere. Somewhere close by. Oh. I don't know that we have enough human slash nano mana machine jump technology to get over that far, do we? Oh, it's all the way up there. I see. I see. I see. Can we get up a little bit higher? Oh, I hope oh, that's the wrong thing to do. Excuse me. Ow. <laughs> do. Away, anyways. Oh, I see. Oh, wow. Oh, really? There's literally nothing there, huh? Groovy. Gotcha. So I wanted to see if there was another. Like, that's. That's such an obvious, like, fucking crawl through past through thing for our drone thing, right? And they didn't make it that way. That's weird. Alright, well, no matter. Just kind of go whoop! See what we can see. It's so worst case, our drone gets destroyed and we resume on our merry way with our normal sort of human body. Ow! Water. Hmm. Wild. Over there. Okay, there's a thing there. Uh, 
whilst I'm thinking about it. Let's mark our map as best we can to come back and read shit, right? Oh, that's the, the big worm front from before. Okay. How helpful that is right now. Oh, hello. Hmm. Boy, it would be handy to be able to blow shit up, huh? got an idea, but I don't know if I can do it anymore since my drone thing just got totaled. And that other thing exploded when it shouldn't have exploded. Let's see if it respawns at some point. Oh, uh, yeah, sure take. I mean, I guess that's good to have a little extra health shit, right? thought now is to get that mine thing to fall. Oh, hey. Oh, whoa, whoa, wait, whoa, buddy. Whoa, hey. Thank you. Okay, yeah, keep following me. That's good. That's good. That's good shit. That's what I want, I think. Um, I don't know where I'm going, but I think, uh, I think that's what I want, right? All right. There you go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Over here, buddy. Over here. Over here. Uh, will, ooh, will he follow me through screen transitions, though? Whoa. Uh, maybe not. Aw. Yeah, come on. This way. Oh, no! <laughs> ah, damn it. Okay. Maybe that was hoping for a, a bit too much there. I wanted to bring him all the way over here, probably. Blow this motherfucker up. That would have been nice, but I don't think that's possible. Looks like most everything else respawned, though. That's nice. Stuck there then. Hmm. Interesting. Okay. Let's make our way down carefully now. Oh, hey, another another urn, another power. What we get. Move and jump more freely underwater. Wow, that's an early ass gravity suit. <laughs> Oh, hey, yeah, look at that. It's, it's normal. Oh, actually, we can jump higher. Cool. All right. Great. Glad I didn't just waste 10 minutes trying to MacGyver drone bomb a wall open. That's cool. I like this. Oh, excuse me. Now we can probably... Oh, hell yeah, look at that. It's so easy. Now we can explore as our human cyborg thing. Oh, I don't know. Kit? Nice. It's 
Oh, and now our drone thing has that same ability. Oh, that's cool. I did not expect that, but that's cool. Urgent message for the royal builder. By consulting with Lamassu and by my own wisdom, determine that the Udug have returned from their ocean caves. May we not be caught in their poison. The master builder has taken up the work concerned. He is to establish securely a hidden vault behind the far chamber of the palace. Let the building work proceed both by night and by the noonday heat. It is urgent. You know it's urgent because they use an exclamation mark. Uh, oh, oh, so what was the important bit here? Yada 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 yada. Securely a hidden vault behind the far chamber of the palace. Okay. Message received. We've recovered that little thing. All right. Our thing. Oh wow, that's like half of our total health. That's that's pretty nice. That's a pretty nice little thing. Can we jump up there? Oh, we can't quite get up there. Unless... Heh! Aw. <laughs> Tease. Ah, oh, we can get up here, though. Ow! Oh, 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 no. Now we've done... Ow! 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 Oh, stop it. Ugh. All right, fine. Okay, well, otherwise the body is harmless, I guess. Shouldn't have wasted my... Well, I guess it wasn't a waste, was it? Uh... Give me a little bit more health so we can stop the beeping. Oh, oh but now we can probably... Get foe. Climb up here, huh? Yeah, look at that. That's nice. Oh, crap. Uh, no, it's probably fine. Still don't have, uh... Still got no explodey power, unfortunately. Wait, what's this? Rotate to the next item. Yeah, sure. Oh! Cool, yeah, 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 yeah. More, more health, please. That's nice. Shit, that's real great. Is there a next, next item? Like a, a bomb or something? Oh no, it's just back to nano juice. Hmm. Okay. I see. I see. Our target always faces backwards. Ah, that's funny as hell. That's gotta make going about your day a bit difficult, right? If you're always backwards. Oh, oh. Well, I didn't want to fall down that far, probably. Oh well, too late. Okay, I don't know if that this dude has a, a wait a vulnerable spot, does he? Can I hack him? I can. Disable, deactivate, power off target. Hell yeah! Fuck you! You ain't doing oh wait. <laughs> oh I see. Wow, alright. Um I don't know how terribly helpful that's gonna be. Ow. Ow! In Ow! Especially at a hundred a pop. Come on, man. Ow! In Ow! Yeah. 
Alright, just let me through. Thank you. Thank you. It's fine. I figured that was gonna apply to the whole the whole thing, you know? Oh hey, but it's another one of those things. Overclock. Next item. There, yeah, that's better. Oh no, he's following me. Hey, sir, no, fuck off. Damn it. Oh, oh dear. No, 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 no. Stop being the weird giant wormy thing. Knock it off. Yeah, how do you like that? Shit. Okay, I don't know how terribly helpful that's gonna be, but... from this main area, but I think I need to get over to the left anyway. Yeah. Oh no, don't do it. Okay, everything's fine. Yeah, this navigates down here. Oh! Double jump! Or bombs? Bombs. This is probably bombs, because look at that fucking explodey wall right to, to the right there. You explode with a shockwave that shakes the earth. Oh, we do, do we? Oh, hell yeah. It costs a hundred. Damn, that's pretty expensive. Boom. Eat shit. Crumbly ass ruins. Oh. <laughs> Alright, but we've got a shortcut from something over there. Alright, now we can- oh, and it dropped that brick. Okay, so now we can do some shit. Now we can do some real cool shit. So we can go get that presumably stronger axe, right? And there's some other stuff above water that we can do now. It's kind of weird, but oh, maybe we can do some shit now, though. Oop, so, oh, well, all right. <laughs> One way to do it. Ow! Jerk. Actually, oh, that's not what I wanted. Oh, well, uh, actually, that kind of works, too. Big. No, 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 no. Oh, well. I get this, so we can do this, and then do this. <laughs> there we go. Feels weird that that's kind of embedded in normal-ass wall there. I guess we'll go with it. Let me climb up there, you, you chodes. Oh, 
Whoa, whoa, secret wall. Oh, this might be the little hint. Oh, shit. <laughs> ah, damn it. Oh, no, which one were we just at? Oh. Okay, that's not bad, I guess. Where the fuck is this, actually? Okay, that's not, that's not too far away. It's fine. That might be the little secret vault thing hinted to us in the tablet thing we picked up earlier, yeah? That's my thought. Uh... Oops. Wait, that looked like a... That looked like an explodey ass wall up there the way it was. Maybe not. Maybe I was seeing things. Ow! Fucking okay. ow! Got me before. Ah! No, 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 no! Okay. Fuck you. He's shit. Aha! Yoink! Oh, it's just a one thing. Did give us a health refill, which is nice. But I feel like that's not the only thing here. This is a big ass area for a little health fragment piece. A little bit suspicious. I mean, aside from the the weird glitch breach thing, of course. But I don't know that I can get to that. Hmm. That looks like a destructo thing, right? Uh, what is it? Ah, Boo! The cracked wall shit threw me off. Alright, no matter. explodey earthquakey thing with just our tiny drone. Mm. Fortunate. Mm. Although I guess that's a little bit higher up than this would be, but that's all sealed off. One tile high face through wall there. Okay, that's fine. Perhaps something to return to. directly off of hanging on a corner. That's neat. Hmm. 
Oh, that's blocked off. <laughs> Boo! Thought I was being sneaky. This was an, I guess, a necessary jaunt to back down here, huh? Because we needed the the explodey power. So we accidentally put ourselves back on the critical path. <laughs> Oops. Not exactly what I wanted to do, but all right, that's fine. More more tools. More equips. More things we can possibly do. want some non-underwater jump boost here. It's not a true action platformer until we get ourselves a double jam. Alright, but explodes acquired, so now we can go visit all that stuff over here. Probably go get that axe, huh? Feel like that's gonna be a weapon upgrade of some description. Could use some more offense, and by extension more defense, because the best defense is a strong offense. I think crazy the Hollow Knight gives you the double jump almost it. Really? Was it that late that we got the double jump in Hollow Knight? I feel like it was perhaps later than expected, but definitely not endgame. Was it? Oh no. I suppose you could always, like, ricochet jump with your needle, or your nail, rather, right? Off of shit, so I get, it's like the poor man's double jump. The poor man's double jump, I suppose, right? It's not all bad. Okay, uh, let's go here, I guess? Boom! Shake that shit down! Give me that fucking... Well, I guess the drone will have to get it for me, but... Give me that whatever that is. Looks important. A bronze axe! Sure. I guess we're Secret of Evermore now. This literally did, uh... Just replaced our ice axe. Oh, cool. Looks cooler. Alright, what else was there around here? I, we've got that thing down there for sure, but let's invest a Mac a few of these other ones. Down to two swipes now. Oh. I mean, one way or another, but I guess we kind of unlock the shortcut, I suppose. the vertical to do that, do we? Oh. <laughs> 
it's pretty much have been the same path. Oh, no, maybe not. <gasps> Shiny blue thing. I want that. How do I get that? It looks important. Oh, that might be like a little nano juice extension or whatever, yeah? that. Oh no, but we can't get up there though. Ooh! Ah! Nuts. Hmm. Shoot. I'm sure there's some like drone ability that you can climb walls or some shit. Later then. the other side of the lake, really? Whoa! <laughs> uh, nuts. Alright, well, even so, I guess once we get back to the save point here, we'll call it a night, because it's getting to be about that time. Which is fine. We can pick this up next week. Oh, wait, can I not get back up? Wait. Can I not get back up there? Excuse me, I would like to ascend this place again. Oh no. Well, I mean, there's one way to do this, right? Go ahead and do a good old death warp. Since I think that's the last, uh... Last place we were at, yeah. There we go. Be pretty easy, yeah? There we go. There we go. She goes back up here. Beautiful. It only hurt a little bit. <laughs> okay, well, let's make double sure and save here. Beautiful. Okay! Uh, oh, I even asked you if you want to save before you go back to menu. Oh, that's neat. Okay. Well, good. That's a good old start on Axiom Verge 2. We got ourselves a better weapon, a flashlight, an explodey power, an extra health tank, storage, dillabop, some other things. We should be in good position to resume this next week then. So that'll do it for tonight. Uh, next stream will be tomorrow night, 7.30 p.m. CDT. Is this the opening lore again? It is. Okay, we don't need to see that. That's fine. Um, 7.30 p.m. CDT tomorrow. Uh, so, our last chance for download in Mars Matrix, but then there's also Gradius Guide uh, remaining for us as well. Friday and Saturday we're off for sure, but then Sunday, 7 p.m. CDT will be long play, more monolith, more attempts at hard mode, sudden death, chaos god. Should be fun. That'll do it for tonight. Thanks for watching, everybody. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye.